Hello and thank you for watching. My name is Rachel Barnett with Gentle Frog. I'm here to create videos for you to help you understand QuickBooks slightly better than you currently do. If you have any comments, questions, or suggestions, please put them in the chat box. Thank you. Hi, my name is Rachel Barnett with Gentle Frog. In this video, I'm going to show you how to accept an invitation to a QuickBooks Online account that was sent to you from your client over to your QuickBooks Online accountant. So when a user invites their accountant to join their QuickBooks Online, this is what they'll get. They'll get an email that says, hey, you've been invited to join this. Um, at some point, I managed to get myself two logins with the migration of T-Sheets. I'm probably not the only one to, to have done this. So I, I just, I pick the Intuit ID I would like to use. And so I'm going to use this one, my Rachel at gentlefrog.com. So let's go ahead and click on use this ID. It'll prompt me and it'll say, okay, what's the ID would you like to use? And I'm like, well, I just told you a second ago, but here it is. This is the one I want. Yes, please. It sends a verification code, which I appreciate. This is where QuickBooks says, okay, we found multiple accounts linked to your email address. I'm just going to pick the first one because I know I don't want the T-Sheets one. I'm going to choose confirm. What happens now is I'm presented with a list of accounting firms that I have access to. Whichever accounting firm I select at this moment is where that client QuickBooks file will get linked to. And so in this case, I want to select my accounting firm and not one of the accounting firms that I provide assistance for. So I will select General Frog. It says success. You've accepted the company's invitation. Choose continue. And this is it. Now again, I have my list of all the accounting firms I have access to. I will select General Frog from the list. This will give me a chance to open up my accounting practice. I now have a list of all the clients that I have available to me that I can review. What I'm going to do is I'm going to search in the find a client box. I'm going to search for a sample. General Frog video sample appears. Once it shows up, I can click on the green plus. This will allow me to view and start working with my QuickBooks file. If for some reason you're not seeing the prompts as I've seen them, um, it might be that you need to clear cash and cookies. It definitely happens to me on a very regular basis that QuickBooks gets confused or that my Chrome browser gets confused and while I'm trying to accept an invitation, I'll get a bunch of funny error messages. Typically you can fix those by clearing your cash and cookies. I hope this video was helpful. If there's anything that my team or I can do for you, please don't hesitate to reach out. We provide bookkeeping and training services and we can be found at gentlefrog.com. Thank you again.